Hello everyone, it's Attack Simpity 2 here, and for today, we have got us up some really exciting Sonic the Hedgehog news for today's video, and the topic we're about to discuss for today is that today, as I'm recording this, the Summer Games Fest, which is basically this month's replacement for E3, which I wouldn't, I'm wouldn't, i not surprised that E3 was cancelled this year, it has revealed a lot of few big games that were shown up, especially from games going from Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, Mortal Kombat 1, more stuff on Spider-Man 2, but most notably, and one of the most exciting parts of it all was another new Sonic game for this year. Never thought I'd see Sonic have a more of a renaissance for this year since 2021 or 2022 and all. I You can tell that Sonic has been getting quite a huge upgrade since those years. Really, but anyways, this new Sonic game is quite a surprise for those 2D classic Sonic fans as this new game is going to be known as Sonic Superstars. It will be arriving this fall of 2023 and... I never really thought I get to see I get to see a another 2D Sonic game, but with the mix of a 3D aspect. First of all, is that this game will be coming out this fall of 2023, and will be available for PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series S, X, and S, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, the Epic Game Store, and Steam, and Steam. So, what is Sonic Superstars all about, exactly? You'd be surprised, but, well, I wouldn't say, but this game is technically Sonic the Hedgehog 5. Yes, Sonic 4 exists, and I know people don't want to get reminded of that, but Sonic... Superstars is kind of, to me, like Sonic the Hedgehog 5. It features the classic 2D platforms that we know about back in the 90s with the mix of the 3D aspects and added in new abilities, new levels, and new environments. Along with the fact that from the screenshots screen scott shots i'm showing you right here you can actually do four player co-op which i never thought i would see in a sonic game uh, like a 2d sonic game of all things which not only do you play as sonic you can also play as tails amy and knuckles so wow a four player co-op i'm getting a lot of super mario new Super Mario Bros. vibes from this, and I guess Kirby's Return to Dream on Deluxe. This is really a great treat, and I can tell that Sonic fans are absolutely eaten this year. We've already gotten the Knuckles show, which is planned to be released by this fall as well, along with Sonic Prime Season 2 on Netflix, and last but not least, the third wave for the Sonic Frontiers free DLC updates. I never thought we'd get to see another Sonic-type related thing. Oh, and the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, I cannot forget about that one as well. Now, another thing I want to mention is that there's more information that they never exactly told you about, but in this game, not only that, they also give out information about this. First off is that this takes place on the North Star Islands. Eggman obviously is the main villain, but what the trailer also showed pretty much in a glimpse was the return of Fang the Sniper, which is a character that appeared in a few occasions of Sonic games, such as Sonic the Hedgehog Triple Trouble, Sonic Mania, which was like the last time we saw Fang in there, and also also a bigger appearance in Sonic the Fighters. That was a really great addition. And the fact that Fang is now a main villain, I really hope that Fang along with, you know, Bart the Polar Bear and Bean the Dynamite are going to be like big mainstay characters. I kind of hope they also give out a lot of, uh, you know, opportunities for other characters as well. Um, oh yeah, not only that, you can also gain brand new powers from the Chaos Emerald. So aside from transforming into Super Sonic, there's also new abilities that you would not seen as well. This game is $60. People thought it was $70, but the official Sonic the Hedgehog Twitter has confirmed that it is $59.99, so don't worry for those that thought this game was going to be in $70, but the most intriguing part about this is the fact that Naoto Oshima, who has been the artist for Sonic arts, such as like the classic 2D Sonic art and all, was, is back once again and is designing a brand new character for this specific game. Who is it exactly? I have no idea, but I am really excited to see who this character might be, and maybe another mainstay to the Sonic franchise? Who knows? And last but not least, I want to mention is that there is also going to be an opportunity to get a free DLC part of the game, pre free DLC inclusion if you use the newsletter from Sonic Superstars. So according to this newsletter right here, it's, it, as it says, sign up by January 31st, 2024 and earn a classic redefined look for Amy Rose. Exclusive to our newsletter, subscribers only, don a modern Amy's classic outfit on classic Amy from Su Sonic Superstars. All you just have to do is simply put your email in and go put, put and it'll be straight in your inbox and will be available to download right after the 
the games released by Discwall of 2023. So, technically, we are playing Modern Amy once again, which, let's be fair, Mo Amy nowadays is never playable in most modern Sonic games. The last time I remember her being a major playable character was in Sonic 06, and I don't think I want to be reminded of that again. But, if Classic Amy is going to get a modern so a modern Amy outfit, that technically makes her makes this her first playable appearance since 06. And that makes me curious, what if the other main trio could get a Sonic could get like a modern redefined design? Who knows? That's probably just me, but seeing this, it's really great to, see, to be a Sonic fan. I've been trying to support Sonic throughout the years and despite its ups and downs, I been saying this, but Sonic has gotten quite a huge renaissance by 2022. But I want to know all your thoughts and opinions down below about this. What do you all think of the announcement of Sonic Superstars? Are you excited about this? Are you skeptical about this? Are you planning to buy this at all? And let me know what you are excited for for this game. Man, this this year for Sonic has been great so far. But with that, leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more videos, follow my Twitter, and I'll see you guys next time. And remember this, once a legend, always a legend.